It's a battle of the big fellas with Rajon Rondo out with right thumb tendonitis. There they are. DeAndre Jordan, DeMarcus Cousins getting set up to battle. And it's DeMarcus Cousins first driving and missing the layup. But he's there for the rebound and the putback. Later, we got a Smitty's under the rim nominee. Look at Chris Paul. The quick yo-yo crossover right there to get the shot and draws the D back in time to get the hoop and harm on that one as well. Paul had 12 in the first quarter alone. Clippers go up by two after the made free throw. Later, Marcus Cousins drives, hangs, and hits the floater, plus the foul. 12 points, eight rebounds, four assists in quarter number one for Boogie. In the second, Chris Paul nails the three-pointer. He had 23 points in the first half, and the Clippers lead at 56-54. Darren Collison gets the steal and takes it all the way for the jam. He had 18 points in the start. Sacramento at 67-64. But the Clippers go on a 20, yes, 20 to nothing run. This is CP3 somehow wiggling in and getting that shot to go. Then Jeff Green, and this is key. Big pickup for the Clippers. Goes the other way and knocks down a three-pointer. He scored 22 points on the game, and the Clippers lead it by a dozen. Chris Paul doing it one more time, knocking down the jump shot here. The Clippers outscored the Kings 34-16 in the third. In the fourth, Jamal Crawford pull up, knock down the jumper, and this one is getting ugly. He had 21. Chris Paul had a lot more than that. He had 40. Knocks down the three on this one, and the Clippers go up to Sacramento and win it by 10. Your final score, 117 to 107.